Just want to say that this video will be going up on both channels. So, let's start the video. Alright, so, I just want to say that this is about Minecraft Live 2021. And I will be streaming it on LEGO Show TV. For you guys who don't know, that is my main channel, LEGO Show TV. I will be streaming Minecraft Live on Saturday. Today is the 11th. I'm getting this video out a little bit later. This video is for both channels. That's why you didn't have an intro for either of them. Because normally when a video is for one channel, I will make an intro. So that's why you don't have an intro for them. Alright. So, last night, very late last night, I put out an Aquatic Land episode. If you don't know what an Aquatic Land episode is, what am I talking about? The server that I'm playing on right now is my server, Aquatic Land. It's actually my second server. And me and my good friend Bryce Films play on it. We play a series known as Aquatic Land. And it is a whitelist server, but that's not what this video is about. I just wanted to tell you guys that that's what, what I'm running around on. So, yeah. So, I'm going to be talking about the first mob they have for the upcoming vote that always happens. Each year since 2017, we have had a biome or mob vote. If you're not aware of how that works, during the event, which is live streamed, which means it is happening live, hence the name Minecraft Live, they will tell you at a certain point that there are three mobs that you can vote for. Well, at this point, here on the 11th, here, we only have one mob. And I'm not going to show you the video. I know other people have, and I know it's probably not copyrighted. So, but I'm still not going to show you, unlike I have in the past, when I showed the video. I'm pretty sure I've showed the video in the past. I'm not going to do that this time. I just don't want to. It's kind of simpler this way, to be quite honest. I just uh, figured that I would talk about it. The first mob that we have here is the Glare. Now, the Glare seems to be a cave mob. Now, I can't remember the name of the Pokemon... But there is a Pokemon, specifically in Pokemon Diamond and Pearl, which is covered in a similar thing to the Glare. And it is kind of looking like the Glare reminds me of that Pokemon. I can't remember. It's one of three Pokemon, actually. But it reminds me of, a, of the... Pokemon, uh, uh, no, Pokemon and Diamond and Pearl. I can't remember right off the top of my head what it is, though. Anyway, what are the special abilities of the Glare? Well, the Glare will help you tell where mobs can spawn. So if you, for example, if we go into a dark cave... If we go into a dark cave and it is not lit up and it is totally dark like some of these are so say this this is not a really good example but the glare would help you it would get grumpy it has the ability to tell you 
where mobs would spawn. Because in 1.18, mobs can only spawn at a light level of zero. There are certain levels. Ooh, geode here. Huh? Okay, I, I'm so confused. What? What is this? Why not, haven't I ever seen it? That's weird. Okay, I'm getting off of the trail here. So, if a mob... If you are in an area where mobs can spawn. So, if you are in a light level of zero, it see that said see that thing that says client light. I believe it has to be zero for mobs to spawn. If it is above zero, mobs cannot spawn once. 1.17 or 18, 1.18 comes out. And plus, right now we are in a Mushroom field area, so you won't need to worry about that. What is this? That's a really cool idea. Now we don't know the other two. We're assuming that we know that this upcoming week they're going to reveal the other two and then let us vote on Saturday. Once again, I want to preference this. I will be starting the video or I will be starting the live stream a little bit early for you guys to watch. Lego on Lego Show TV. This video will also be on. It will be on both channels. But it'll be on Lego Show TV. The stream will start a little bit before 11 a.m. I will make sure that I can get where no background noise is a thing. So uh, yeah. I'll make sure of that. I will be coming on here probably the next two days to tell you about the mine, the Minecon mobs, Minecraft mobs, the other two that will come out, I'm assuming tomorrow and Wednesday. There probably won't be a snapshot, so I probably, probably won't have a snapshot video. I will try to have another episode of Aquatic Land out sometime this week. Mm -hmm. And uh, if you are not subscribed to my second channel, please subscribe if you are a fan of Minecraft. There will be a edited video not only on Lego Show TV. I know that Lego Show TV is primarily a Lego channel, but it is a main part of my fan base. Subscribes to Lego Show TV. So, yeah, that's uh, what is going to happen. There should be a picture of the glare at the end of the video here. So you should see what it looks like at the end. And yeah. I'm very excited. I may cast the vote for this mob depending on what the other ones look like. So yeah. 
You guys make your own choice. Don't let me influence you on how to vote in this mob vote. I think we still need the other biomes. If you're not aware, 2017 mob vote was the Phantom that won. 2018 saw the Taiga get a small update and introduce sweetberries and foxes and campfires. So we wouldn't even have a campfire if the Taiga hadn't won. And we may have not had part of Caves and Cliffs. Is that a goat? What? What is that? What is that skeleton horse? Oh, it's a wolf. What's a wolf doing here? Hey, what are you doing here? You're a wild one. That's odd. I'm gonna tame you. Come back here. This is a late video, but if you want to vote for the glare, vote for the glare. Don't let me influence you. Don't let other people influence you. Wait until you see all three mobs, then cast your vote on Saturday. Remember to uh, watch the live stream when I'm live on Lego Show TV. I don't do live streams very often. This is the one exception. So, uh, yeah. I just don't have the ability to do, or the time to do a lot of live streams. No. Like I see other YouTubers do. So, that being said, I'm going to end this video. There will be a picture of the glare at the end. And yeah, please comment, like, and subscribe. Remember everything I've told you. October the 16th, which is Saturday. And just coming up in the next couple of days. We will see the other two mobs revealed. Now, theories on what those two mobs are. I think one of them will at least be related to the update. Now, the glare looks like it would belong in the Lush Caves. So, maybe that would be the whole purpose of it. I don't think we're going to get another Caves update. I think Caves and Cliffs is going to be enough. Right now, kind of like the Nether update. I think they're going to lead toward maybe an end update or sky update that'd be cool a sky update or the other biomes like i said we wouldn't have the the taiga mm -hmm. we wouldn't have the sweet berries the foxes and campfires if the taiga didn't win and we wouldn't have half of caves and cliffs <sighs> If in 2019, the other, if the, the cliffs didn't win, the mountains didn't win. No. Now, we only still need, I know I said I gotta go, and I do, but I just want to say that the ma or the uh, biomes that lost were the desert, the savanna, the badlands, and the swamp. No. And we still need those to be updated. So, that being said, tune in tomorrow for another video and possibly an Aquaticland episode 
I don't know if it'll be tomorrow. I said maybe tomorrow uh, on Tuesday, but I'm I'm not confirmed. I'm not going to say that anymore. So, if you have enjoyed this video, please comment, like, and subscribe. Here's the picture of the glare once the main video goes off. Please comment, like, and subscribe. And here's a cool picture of the glare.